Welcome back, everybody. This your girl, Have a Sit. I want to thank all my subscribers. I truly appreciate y'all. Okay, so this is going to be a daily reading for August 22nd, 2017. This is going to be for the day after the eclipse, okay? And I'm using after tarot, all right? So basically, this reading is five seconds later, all right? Let's keep it moving. Now, the overall energy for the 22nd, okay, we have the Five of Pentacles. So that's about putting yourself in somebody else's shoes. Don't leave nobody out in the cold. It's about helping somebody. It's about supporting somebody, okay? If they down and out, help they ass, okay? Do not walk past they ass like you don't see them. I clarify that you got the Five of Cups. It's about do not turn your back on somebody because you feel a certain type of way, okay? Because you can have an opportunity to help somebody, but you so you so focused on your own hurt that you're not even realizing somebody else needs your help, okay? It's time to get out of that negativity. It's time to raise your vibration, okay? Because we ain't doing this shit no more, okay? Ain't nobody going back to what was, okay? This is a new fucking day all right i clear feather you at the page of swords it's about communication okay when you see somebody on the street speak okay it's about speaking the truth all right let's keep it moving <laughs> now the foundation of this day you got the seven of wands so that's about having one up being prepared i clear feather you got the tower so when something change, some get torn down, a major fucking destruction, be prepared for that shit. I clear feather you got judgment. So it's definitely finna be a final decision made. So hopefully you are prepared for it. Alright? Let's keep it moving. Now in the past, okay, we was the hermit. So, we had time to think about what's going on, what we want to do. Uh, Claire Feather got the Three of Cups. You had time to think about how you want to live your life. Uh, Claire Feather, you got the Hierophant. You had time to think about what you want to commit to, what you want to teach, what you want to do. Basically, you had time to think that. So... Just be prepared for the worst or the good. But it's finna be a final decision. Alright? Let's keep it moving. Now, the situation for the day is temperance. Balance. You had to go through the bad to know what was good. I clarify that you got the six of swords so that's about moving on from a situation that don't cause you no balance you're gonna have to move on what's crossing that is the eight of pentacles so that's about putting time putting energy into something that brings you balance what's crossing that i mean i clarify that and you got the king of swords so that's about working hard on making decisions based on facts, truths. Like, ain't nobody got time for no illusions, okay? I clarify that. You got the Seven of Cups. So it's like, make sure you think. Before you make a decision, okay? Think before you make a decision. Don't just make one and then expect everything to be okay. You're going to have to think this shit through. You're going to have to put time and energy into making a decision. Do not just jump the gun, okay? Let's keep it going. What's well, crowning this is the Queen of Swords. So that's having a gift of gab, having that confidence in when you speak, okay? I clear for that you got the Five of Wands. It's about talking out your problems. 
Talk them out. It ain't no sense of fighting. I clarify they get the magician. So it's about putting shit into action. Okay, we done. Like, um. Okay, this is what we finna do. No, we actually doing that shit. Okay, we doing it now. Ain't nobody finna be talking about it. Okay, we actually doing it. Okay. Now. How you see yourself. You got the Ten of Swords. So, basically, it's time for a rebirth. You done went through the pain. You done went through the suffering. You don't have no more life left. Like, it's... What's next? You get the Ace of Swords. The Ace of Wands, I'm sorry. A new beginning. To whatever you passionate about. Okay? An attraction. Alright? So... You done been through the hard times, okay? It's definitely time for a new start. Now, as the situation you can put, continue to play out, you get the star. So you got faith. You got hope. I clarify that, you got the two of cups. So you got faith in a relationship, in a partnership. I clarify that you got the devil. So you got faith and hope that can't nobody pin you down and make you do nothing you don't want to do. Get that shit out your damn head, okay? Because ain't nobody finna be dealing with no obsessions and addictions. and You got control over that shit. Believe that. What's influencing this is the nine of pentacles. That's enjoying the fruits of your labor. That's just being independent. That's just doing what the fuck you want to do. And your hope and fear, you got the ten of cups. So we know that's a hope. Who fearing the ten of cups? Okay? You want everything. The family, the house, the kids, the grant. You want it all. You hoping for it, for it all. Now, after you just keep the faith in a relationship, a partnership, two people, friendship, whatever. And it's like, keep believing that can't nobody control you. Can't nobody control you. Keep believing that shit. After this. You get the Eight of Cups. So, it's about... Thinking before you walk and walk away. Because it's like, what are you really leaving behind? What you really want to walk away from? Is it worth walking away? Or it was just like some type of disagreement and it's like, oh, I'm walking away. I can't deal with it. Because to clarify that, you got the nine of cups. So be careful because you don't want to walk away from a situation that's fulfilling your needs. And one little argument and one little disagreement and now you was ready to turn your back. So make sure you know what you're walking away from before you walk away. Don't just walk away and regret it later. I clarify that you got the world. So you completed a cycle like you at peace right now. You at peace. Alright. So yeah y'all. This eclipse. It definitely. Changed. The game. Alright. So just make sure you just put yourself into somebody else's shoes. Alright. Think about. Somebody else. Besides yourself. You know what I'm saying y'all. So, yeah, that's really all I got for August 22nd. And if this is making sense, thumbs up. And if you'd like to donate, it's all good. I truly appreciate it. Sent from heaven, 225 at gmail.com at the PayPal. You already know. Peace out.